Hi there, how do you make a good impression through your online photograph? Hi, it's Sue Curry with your Friday FAQ and this week we're going to look at your professional profile photograph and the brand image that you want to portray and I'm going to give you a couple of tips on how to make that positive first impression because after all that first impression is made online these days. So the first thing I'm going to suggest is use a professional photographer. Now I know a lot of people don't feel comfortable having their photographs taken which is pretty incredible in this day and age when selfies are everywhere but the main thing is that really a selfie is not going to cut it for your professional photograph so you need to have something that's going to portray the business image that you want to portray that professional image of who you are and what it is that you do so use a professional photographer they will help you feel comfortable but also don't rely on them exactly telling you what to do and what you want because you're the only person who knows what you want so have a look at the fonts and the colors and the business images that you already have and think about well what is that brand image that you want to put put across and what you can do then is cut out some images have a look at some images in business magazines or in newspapers that have been taken by professional photographers and that will give you a sense of what it is that you're trying to put across and then take those along to the photographer they're what they call tear sheets and uh, that's something we used to use back in my modeling days that was my very first job and I actually did that for 15 years so I know about how how to work with photographers and we take tear sheets along uh, to have our portfolios designed the way that we wanted to have them designed so tear sheets take them along to your photographer and that will help with your brand image the next thing to think about is the pose now really you don't have to think about that too much they will help you they'll guide you where to stand and where to look and what to do uh, but really you're thinking about a head and shoulders photograph initially however if it is for a full length photograph they may suggest that you know you turn to the side or you know you might tilt your head or perhaps stand on your back foot to uh, if it's a full length image perhaps for a banner or something like that so don't worry about it too much the photographer will guide you into what to do but the most important thing is for you to remember is that nice warm friendly expression that's what's going to make that strong first impression now you don't have to be all toothy and smiley if that's not your your style but a warm friendly expression so look through the lens of the camera Think about a happy moment or someone you care about and think about that time that it takes you back and just a nice, warm, friendly expression. That's when they'll snap the shot, shot, uh, the shot and that's going to be the best image for you. So I hope those few tips do help you shine in your next profile photograph that you have taken. And if you need some help, get in touch because we do have a range of photographers that we work with. However, you can just simply look up personal branding photographer in your state or wherever it is that you live and I'm sure you'll find someone who can help you. So until next time, keep shining.